In this video, you will learn how to install a black comb UV disinfection system. Install vertically or horizontally using the clamps provided. Vertical installation is preferred and we will demonstrate this in this video. Using the supplied fasteners to mount the provided clamps to wood or drywall, make sure to leave at least an additional reactor length to facilitate lamp and sleeve removal. Place reactor in clamps. Put clips on. Connect to water supply. If you have a 6.1 unit, install the UV sensor. Align the flat portion so it matches up with the half metal lip on the sensor port. Install the sensor so it is fully seated and hand tighten the sensor nut. Note, if you do not have a UV sensor, your unit will come with a glow plug. Make sure to leave this installed. Remove new quart sleeve from its packaging using soft, lint-free gloves. Insert new sleeve into the chamber, domed side in, ensuring that it is straight and sits right in the middle of the basket at the other side of the chamber. Once the sleeve is seated, remove the new o-ring from its packaging and place it on top of the new sleeve. Drop the spring into the quart sleeve. Screw on gland nut, hand tight only, no tools required. Turn on the water supply and check for leaks. Test bypass valve. The most common leak is from the o-ring not making a proper seal. If this is where it is leaking from, remove the gland nut and make sure that the o-ring is fully seated in the chamber. Mount the controller to the wall above or beside the reactor to ensure that no moisture can deposit on any of the connections. Always mount vertically. Plug in UV sensor to IEP port on right side of controller if using a monitored unit. Install the lamp key. Carefully place the lamp into the sleeve and connect it to the lamp connector. Push in into the gland nut and twist one quarter turn clockwise to lock it into place. Tighten the ground screw onto the ground lug on the UV reactor. Plug into your GFCI outlet. 